drunk again. Say no. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. Friends for life, we said. And now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Do you know what betrayal means, Bertram? No. It means hurting Miss Marjorie. <laughs> Why, well, I thought you liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Yes, and Miss Marjorie likes Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that nasty little Magnifico has run off to so I can get on with weapon that's not nose running to shape? He owes me. He owes us. Big time. Bertram and Marjorie. Would Bertram like a sherry? Bertram. Like Sherry. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> Barkeep Sherry. Make it the cheapest one you have. Rat piss will do. His pretty dance. Everything okay? Imagine saving people, no. taking them to your breast, and metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring and raising them, and then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Whoa. Treachery! And these are sad, low, unlovable people, and I made them stars, dreamers, entertainers, and they... Oh, no, now family's not enough. No, no, he's gone off alone. My little tiny magician has gone and stabbed his mom on the back. Oh, fuck it, he... No, Bertram! 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 Woof, woof! Bertram! Put the nice man down! Do something! You only eat him! Um, easy there. Easy there! Sherry! Bertram! Easy, pig guy. Not nice! Bad Bertram! Ah, mean! Mean man! Let's be friends, okay? No fair! Dear Lord, you'll be even more stupid! You have Sherry, Bertram Wand. <gasps> Ouchie! Now, <coughs> Bertram got a whoopsie. Enough! <laughs> Cut that out! <coughs> You're gonna be a right mess! <laughs> yum, gonna be yum, you my dumb. <coughs> <coughs> You're gonna be hell! Yum, 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 <laughs> He's strong, all right, Bert. Uh, hurt you. Uh, sit. Uh, sit down and be good. Uh, you birds of crush, squash, break. No one likes a tantrum, mister. Uh, bad! Bertram! Uh, Your head's gonna pop off. No Easy, boy. Okay. Thank you. Come here, Bertram. <laughs> oh, yes. Marjorie's here. No one's gonna hurt you ever again. Mama. You should keep that thing in a cage. Maybe you should think about who you're serving. 
Give me a beer, will you? Don't worry. We'll pay for what we broke. Come here, Bertram. Oh, no one looks after you like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do. Especially not that Magnifico. Hmm? But he's my friend. Yes, well, if he were your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. Mama's gonna make it all better. But first, you gotta tell me what that little worm ran off to, hmm? Huh? Bertram promise. Yes, well, Magnifico made a promise, too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract, and he broke it. So you just tell me exactly where he is, and then we will all be even. That's my boy. He's camping in the woods. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. You gave me a whoopsie. You just stay away from that share, you hear? Bertram likes sharing. Oh, don't you get him started. Thank you for all of your help, Mr. Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. Oh, his name is Magnifico. You'll know him when you see him. Come along, Bertram.